The bizarre only in California, Hurricane, as many are calling it, still has people talking. Not only we were dealing with the remnants of a hurricane, but SoCal also had a sizable earthquake. I like the nickname. Yep. Yep. Well, people throughout the area got the loud and surprising quake alert. KCAL's Jeff DeWin has more on the early warning alert designed to help save lives. I don't remember signing up. Um, as far as I know, it just popped up. Miriam Karkashatse got an alert like this on her phone Sunday. <laughs> Soon after a 5.1 magnitude quake hit about four miles south of Ojai, the Shake Alert Earthquake Early Warning System is managed by the U.S. Geological Survey. Dr. Robert DeGroot says the warnings are delivered through the wireless emergency alert system. Alerts about weather, about missing people, amber alerts, etc., all come through that same system, and now we're delivering earthquake alerts. The purpose of the system is to reduce the impact of earthquakes and save lives and property. Like slowing down trains, closing, closing water valves, opening firehouse doors. DeGroot says for the first time, Cedar Sinai Medical Center had its system activated through its partnership with Shake Alert. If you were at Cedars, you likely would have heard the PA system telling you to basically earthquake, protect yourself, drop cover, and hold on. As soon as it started, uh, this one started freaking out a little bit. Uh, so yeah, definitely saw an earthquake. Uh, the lamps were shaking. Shamine Renee says she did not get an alert on her phone, but her dog sensed the earthquake before her. Depending on how far you are from the epicenter, the shake alert may give you precious seconds to find cover. And it wouldn't hurt to be notified either way, whether it was small or it was big. The shake alert warning is already part of Google's Android operating system. iPhone users can go into their emergency settings to opt in or sign up through shakealert.org. We have a link on our website, kcalnews.com. Click Seen on TV. In Pasadena, Jeff Nguyen, KCAL News.